shoved into the spotlight by unspeakable tragedy. Tonight, Pulse nightclub owner Barbara Poma joined the parents of Matthew Shepard in calling out hate crimes, and they zeroed in on the crimes happening right here in Central Florida. News 6's Eric Sandoval was one of the only reporters invited to this. He's live with more on what came out of their discussion tonight. Eric, yeah, Eric this happened actually at Parliament House tonight, and you know, we want to make it absolutely clear. Investigators never declared what happened at Pulse nightclub a hate crime. Now that said, I spoke with Matthew Shepard's parents tonight and they minced no words about how they felt about that. And to me, it was a homophobic hate crime. Dennis and Judy Shepard say they were overseas when they first heard about the shooting at Pulse. It just reopened a lot of wounds. We knew what those folks were going through, their parents, their friends. Matthew was the type of person it reopened wounds because of what happened to their son 20 years ago this year. 21-year-old Matthew Shepard, a student at the University of Wyoming, was found tied to this fence outside Laramie. Police say he had been beaten almost unrecognizable and left to die in the cold, targeted because he was gay. There is no such thing as gay rights. What we're talking about here are equal rights. Tonight, his parents, Pulse owner Barbara Poma, and representatives from virtually every law enforcement agency in the Orlando area talked about fighting hate crimes head on. According to the Matthew Shepard Foundation, 85 hate crimes have been reported in the metro Orlando area since 2012. At least 25 of them targeted members of the LGBTQ community. Judy Shepard praised Orlando police and the Orange County Sheriff's Office for reporting their hate crimes to the FBI. They really get it, and not all police departments are that good. They don't have liaisons, they don't care. Now we're getting ready for one week from tonight, which will mark two years since the Pulse nightclub shooting. Tomorrow night, the One Pulse Foundation will host a fundraiser featuring an evening with the Shepherds. We put a link to that and also ways that you can report hate crimes on our website at clickorlando.com.